Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with The Rising of the Shield Hero season 2 episode number 13. And this is the final episode of this season I think. The previous episode felt like the final episode but I guess this is the official final episode. And uh, I'm kind of curious what we're going to see today like I don't know like for 20 minutes like like it's kind of weird if you think about it like they could have used this one episode to kind of go deeper into a few other stuff that they skipped instead they put this episode in the end I don't know why where it feels as if the 12th episode was the final one so I don't know let me watch this episode first then I'll see if this episode was necessary or not if this was not necessary this episode they could have just used this before to kind of go a little bit deeper into the stuff but I don't know let's see what happens here today and uh, yeah then I'm going to talk about it and I'll give my general impression I talked about my shield hero in the previous video as well I'll give a more general opinion about this show all in all and everything but yeah let's start first okay so this is episode number 13 so yeah let us begin I'll be putting the subtitles on the timer here thank you to whichever is your preference and let's get started all right here's the countdown three two one Go. Okay. So, are we going back home or something? Like home, I mean, uh, now uh, Raftarius, uh, now from his world. Wait, why is she sneaking? Okay. Ah, back to the good old days, Philo. Oh. Wait, is this? No, wait, what's happening? when is this happening like after that obviously raf is here with us i'm kind of confused what's happening here Like yeah, this is after what everything happened. He she, she he has the armor. Raf is here with him. Is she trying to fly? <laughs> oh, we are back here in the our world. Yeah, that did happen in the previous episode, but. I was guessing we we're going to see more of the okay never mind <laughs> Oh my god I love how Raf is sitting like this <laughs> Mikaka oh um yeah what's happening here wait I'm kind of confused. They could have shown this while the show itself was happening. Why are they showing this after? Like they rushed that part and now they're... what? This is weird. Like... <laughs> yeah.
Hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My God. All right, yo, Rafter and Nafu is just <laughs> looking at his web. Whoa, what the? Yeah, obviously. Oh my god, what? <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> yo. Wow. <laughs> okay. They even have maid outfit in this world. Okay, I guess. What is happening here? All right, so I'm okay. <laughs> this is not a beach episode, what? <laughs> Uh, Nafu is just looking at his weapons and the shields. Yeah. Ah. Hmm. <laughs> Enough. <man. laughs> Ninja girl. What? <laughs> Mine has the. <laughs> Perfect. That's the best. <laughs> wow, this guy. Yeah, he's a shield hero, you know, so. Yeah, it's a lot of defense. <laughs> oh my god, these two are fishing. They could have easily shown this on, on when this was happening. Like. Mm. Oh. Yeah, well, she was stuck. Okay. Yeah. Ah, then fantastic. I had a blast. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Okay. So we're gonna. Sh oh, here we go. Yeah, these are monsters, so sh she can easily fight them. Hmm. Hmm. 
Who knows? Yo, what? Oh, those are. Oh no, that's a big one. Oh yeah, that's why Nafumi said she can easily make fire. <laughs> The first few days, she probably had like a lot of enthusiasm or something, but then it started getting. Oh my god. <laughs> Nasty fishes. What the hell are these? Ugh. Yeah, no wonder you're eating those demonic fishes. Wow, that's a really handy weapon. Okay, so she did try to go. Okay, and she just. I'm. Uh, there you go. That invisible wall you have on video games, you know. <laughs> well. He goes back. Yeah, you don't have salt. You need salt, you know, like... I guess the, she did have the ocean in front of her, but how can she make salt out of the ocean? Oh my god. Oh, this is where she tries to... Oh my god. Oh. Yeah. Ah, there you go. She can make salt. Oh, she started talking to the ball. Yeah. It makes a lot better, you know, salt. <laughs> yep. We don't usually realize because we usually use salt and everything. But when we don't get salt, we're like, damn. And she's making sugar. No, that's salt, sorry. That's not sugar. Yeah, how can we make sugar, you know? Like, we don't have any sugar cane here. And, and here's where she made snuff for me, I guess. Like she just, yeah, there you go. Like they could have easily done this as like a flashback, you know, and that when this was happening. Like it would have made, I don't know, like made it a lot more better, I think. Like why are they including this now? Wait. Oh, I I thought she was talking about the penguin. I know. <laughs> ah. Damn. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Does she even have any? I don't know. Oh, okay.
Hmm. Wait, are we going to see more about Kyo? I don't want to see his face again, please. Us. Well, that's funny, but... Yeah... That was... That was a fun thing she... Um, yeah, was that it? Oh, my God. Uh. Like, it's so sad. I thought we were going to get like a flashback. He doesn't even have a flashback dedicated to him. <laughs> oh, my God. Yo, I was thinking we're going to go into a flashback, you know, we're going to see that scene. <laughs> he didn't even have a flashback dedicated. She just spoke verbally. Stop, you have the, oh my god. She's... <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> she wants to fly so much. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> maybe who knows? Like when she'll become a better philolier queen, maybe she can fly. Ah. Yeah, that's true. What? What? Um, yeah, something probably happened which we don't know. Maybe we're going to see this, that now? I think so, yeah, there you go, flashback. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Um Wait, what? Uh, no, she's not. You might be okay with it, but not. She's not. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was the way. Years of twitching. Oh my god! Stop. What? Yo, stop! Fido, go to sleep! <laughs> I don't think so. What, what are you... T oh my god, yo! Oh, wait. <laughs> she died. Okay. <laughs> my god.
<laughs> Your feel is like. <laughs> oh my god. God damn. <laughs> Oh my god, okay. I'm scared to them. Okay. <laughs> oh god. Oh, is it sp the spirit? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Flowers offered in recollection. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Oh boy, this is a weird episode, you know? Like, it feels like, like some kind of a extra episode. I don't know, like, couldn't they have... Uh, I don't know. They, couldn't they have done this before? Like, included these... But uh, I guess, like, the whole atmosphere was kind of, like, you know, tense up until now. So maybe they couldn't add these funny sections over there. It would probably just defeat the whole, I think, the atmosphere of the show, like the way it was going, I don't know. But okay, so yeah, we get a few sections. It's not a recap, I would say. It's kind of extra, some extra sections being included. And it seems it kind of feels weird because after everything has happened they're just recollecting it while i don't know i like they could have done if, if they took their time with this i'm especially the second part i think they could have done a very they could have done a better job here like like she, season one was so good and like season two like became like this like there were particular episodes that i really liked so i feel like if all the episodes that we saw if they were made with the similar in the similar way or you know it could have been a better they could have taken their time and done it a lot better way but like i understand i guess they probably had like a deadline or something like oh 13 episodes in like in a complete from this part to this part, you have to complete it. Like, that's what happens, I, I think. You know, like, they are given, like, a amount of time and an amount of budget, and they're like, oh, do the job. And, yeah, the studio can have no hand in this. Like, they, they cannot do anything. Like, the higher-ups are the one who, I guess, dictate what to do. And this was their decision, I guess. I don't know why, but, yeah. This is bad. Like it's it feels so sad to see Shield Hero in like you know having like a six point seven rating. It's sad, you know. It's, it's such a sh good show. Season one was so good, and this is the state that it's in now. So 
Rajan and see how an offer Thank you, okay. Hmm. Okay, I think that's the end. Yeah. So yeah, like I was saying, like you know, like it's so it's so sad to see this show in like a six point seven rating. Like it's so sad. I, I was so excited for this season and yeah, like this is how it goes. Uh like I said, like you know it like the first part was really kind of what can I say? Like had a lot of information and everything. It was kind of going becoming a little tedious and like and I kind of heard from everyone else discussing. They said like, oh the first part, you know, like will be a little bit like you know have a lot of information, it'll be kind of boring, but the next part is going to be good. And I was like, all right, let me, let me, like, you know, let me wait for the time. And when the, the second part started, it was nice, you know, like it started in a very like dense way. It was kind of going in a good direction. But then I realized the problem with the second part is it was rushing it. It was rushing it so bad and the animation got atrocious by the end of it. You remember the uh, episode with Yomogi? Her face was crazy. Her face was doing some crazy stuff, you know, like one eye was here, one eye was there, and I'm like, what is, what is happening here, you know? Here in this episode, however, the animation is quite good. Like, it's crazy how the animations kind of change, like, you know, like in the different ways, and I don't, I don't expect some good, like, you know, amazing quality animations, some decent animations, you know, like, but it kind of became like that. So, animation not good, the pacing is just bad, you know, like they're rushing everything. So the second part was also equally not good. Uh, we just got to know the extra development that we got. Like, you know, like uh, Raftalia became the Katana hero. We saved um, Kizuna, the wave started, Kyo is dead. The other guy, uh, what was his name? I forgot. Anyways, he's dead. And uh, yeah, we saved Philo and we get got to know more about Glass and everyone, you know, who they are and all that stuff. So yeah, all, all those things. That's all we got to know. Like, you know, like, other than that, the excitement that I felt while watching season one, none of it is in here. None of it. Like, that's why, you know, like, it's kind of disappointing by the end. Like, another thing I feel like, like, I feel so weird watching, like, on the fact, like, you know, there's, like, another problem that this, this season had, which I, I kind of feel, I still feel weird about it. The way Rafumi is so attached to Ost. You know, I feel like since they rushed the first part, we barely got to see any development between Ost and the crew. You know, like Ost was there for a few episodes, just a couple of episodes. And then, you know, like she sacrificed herself. And it feels so weird seeing a character with such less amount of character development in the anime. And Naofumi becoming so attached. Like I know why Naofumi is so attached to Ost because a lot of development probably happened in the light novel because they did not rush it, I think, you know, they probably went through everything little by little and took that time to develop the relationship and everything. That's why by the end of it, now for me and everyone was so attached to Ost. What happened in the anime? They, they, they did the whole first part in like five or six episode in which Ost was in like two, maximum three episodes, Ost was there for the majority of the time. So like two episodes worth of character development. That's what happened in the anime. Well, I'm pretty sure in the light novel, the character development was quite big, was quite immense. They, like, you know, got, like, you know, kind of, they kind of went together, did stuff together, and they got attached to each other. And that's why Naofumi is so sad with Ost, like, you know, uh, dying and, you know, him. Like, this is, this is something that really surprised me but like i was really confused even by the end of it i was like why is now for me so much like you know attached to ost like what is the reason behind it like you know like now for me is a type of a character who barely you know like who keeps his, himself emotionally um not like you know it doesn't invest in other people emotionally he tries to be aloof most of the time because of the things in that happened in season one that's why I was so confused. I was like, what is happening? Why is he so, so much attached to, attached to Ost? Or why is he so much caring about Ost? Like, what is happening? And then it struck. I'm like, oh, the anime rushed. The anime rushed the story. That's why all the character development that happened were probably just skipped. And we barely got to see anything, I think. 
That's why, like, obviously they cannot change the story. So the, the attachment that now from Phil's to us host, they're showing that in the end with barely any character development in the anime, which the light novel got, I'm guessing. So there you go, there I got my answer. I'm like, all right, it makes so much sense now. So that's one thing that I realized, like, you know, like after watching this. And uh, like I said, the first part, the whole host section and everything, it was okay. And I was kind of waiting for it to end so that the next part could start because people were saying like the next part is kind of really interesting. But the next part got rushed as well and I'm like, what was the point then, you know? This season was just disappointing. I wouldn't say bad, I'm going to say disappointing because season 1 was so good and I had an equal expectation dropped, dropped down completely. So yeah, I'm, I'm not going to talk about this episode that much because we just got a few, I guess, side stories you could say, like, you know, little haha sections like little funny sections if you can say like the first part was uh, like you know philo um now for me them like you know kind of recalling about the like you know the portion where uh izuna and uh Raftale, they went to like the the clothing store and like you know brought like clothes and everything we get a little little swimsuit <laughs> like you know kind of section <laughs> little fan service section and there you go, that, that was it, that was that. And we got to see how Raftaya got her clothes. Then we get a little bit of Yo, uh, Yomogi and uh, Kizuna, where Kizuna recounts her situation, how, what he did, she did when she went to the, to the she, she arrived at the uh, dimension, the other dimension. And I'm guessing they could have easily included this, you know, in, in, when this was happening. I don't know why they decided to include this now. But either way, we kind of get a little bit more development, nothing much. All that we saw here is something that I kind of guessed that it happened. So just seeing this as like, uh, yeah, I, I kind of guessed this. This is probably what happened. Like, you know, she cut down tree, made a fire, started fishing, tried to eat, you know, and uh, got bored, got sick of it. They probably tried to like, you know, get out of the situation by rowing away, making a boat failed came back probably got more sick of the whole situation and tried to hang herself and then she was like no i'm not going to do that i'm going to survive and after that made her up now for me there you go that's what they showed and i'm i guessed everything i, I knew this was, it was it was definitely something like that that happened so it was no surprise it was just like you know they kind of showed that part i feel like they could it would have been better if they showed this a little bit earlier maybe you know raftelia could recount her tale to Naofumi like you know like tell him that oh this is what happened or if nothing of that sort maybe like a little flashback that she went into when when the, the the episodes were ongoing maybe that you know it would have been I think it would have been a lot better than just telling this to us now I don't know just my opinion but yeah that was that and uh, then we get a little section about Kyo uh, one funny part of this episode was I love how Kyo did not get any flashback. Like, <laughs> like all the like you know situations when they were recounting something, you know the 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 clothing section, like you know when they brought new clothes. He's not talking about. <coughs> excuse me. He's not talking about what happened when he was in that island. All that, you know, when they were recounting those tales, we get a flashback. You know, like we see what was happening. So when Yomogi started talking about Kyo, I was like, oh my god, please stop. I don't want any Kyo flashbacks. And we did not have. And I'm like, wow, <laughs> that's funny. Because, you know, Kyo is so irrelevant that she didn't even get a flashback, an animated flashback. Yomogi, <laughs> he just told us verbally. And I'm like, yeah, that's kind of funny. Uh, <laughs> and... Uh, like that was that and yeah and what else and then we get to now for me back now for me again and here we get a little uh, another story a little you know story of how Ost kind of had a little bit fun and like kind of teased Raftalia um like you know Arishia and Philo as well like kind of that section you know that section and it was yeah okay I guess and there you go. And then after that, everyone goes and prays respect to Ost. Nafumi looks behind, looks at Ost, and 
there you go smiles and goes on her way his way so that's why like i said you know this part when she he looks back and sees ost like it kind of struck me i'm like why is now for me so attached to ost what's even happening like i i didn't see any kind of character development between these two and then i'm like oh yeah the anime skipped stuff so it probably happened we just don't know <laughs> So there you go it, it, it kind of made sense after that why now for me is just so hell-bent on getting you know the re i wouldn't call it revenge but the retribution yeah the revenge for host and why he was so much emotionally invested at host's death all that so yeah and that's where it ends so there you go now this is the first like you know the, the season two i'm season 3 has also been confirmed and i really don't know if I, i'm actually like you know uh like i'm actually going to continue this version i'm going to obviously watch the show you know like even if i don't re like the next season when it comes even if i don't react to it i'll definitely watch the show because i watch all most animes most seasonal animes i watch so i'll, I'll kind of decide later on whether to react to season three when it comes out or not because i myself has been, have been such so disappointed with this one like i'm like ugh, if this doesn't change it it really won't like you know like i don't know like i can just watch this on my own you know just doing some other stuff i can just watch it and then, but the kind of reacting to it taking time where i could easily react to some other show which is a lot more interesting you know that's actually the situation now so that's why you know like when this is going to come out season three i'll, I'll look at it if there's like any other like you know show that i might have to like you know like shield hero was my first priority up until now so if i see some other show which sounds a lot more interesting than the way this is happening now you know i i might just watch shield hero on my own not react to it and i don't know what i'm going to do but it'll all depend later on i'll like you know we, we'll see because this season was no it's definitely not this is definitely not how it should have gone it's so disappointing so yeah i'm sad i'm really sad about like this this really was one of my like you know one of my most beloved isekais you could say i just loved it so much and this is what happens in season two and uh, let's see hopefully season three is a lot better than this they they I, I pray to god they don't rush it anymore so yeah and i pray to god that like you know season three gets a eight uh above rating like it's it's sad to see this in 6.7 you know the rating is 6.7 or even lesser than that i think i don't know at which point it is now but yeah so anyways that's it guys so thanks for watching this was my uh reaction to the final episode episode number 13 of the rising of the shield hero season 2 if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed comment down below anything you want to say anything you want to let me know and i'll check them out and yeah that's it uh obviously a, a new show is going to replace this uh a few seasonal shows um you know like a few uh, look at the shows that are coming I, I talked about it in another video uh, but if you guys want to know i'll kind of like you know, list the new shows that i'll be reacting to after this um uh, devil is a part time season two um overlord uh made in abyss um what else uh danmachi yofukashi no uta i think call of the night that's the name um uh that that one uh uh, that one the, the one w w which has the same author as takagi-san uh I, I, Kuru, I, I, I think what was the girl's name i forgot that one you know that one and there's another show that I'm, i'll be reacting to which is which one is it like oh yeah these shows you know like these shows i'll be reacting to and if you're interested in you know like watching my reactions to any of them yeah tune in and uh, I'll, I'll start reacting to them as soon as they start airing so, so that's it guys um <clears throat> just a sec um there's another show that I, I was going to react to oh classroom of the elite there you go these shows so yeah we'll see you guys uh in the next video that i make uh, and uh, with some new shows new reactions and uh, yeah so thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video until then goodbye
and have a nice day.